finally, we got some authentic gangster music from a guy that actually robs, murder, and steals. Wait a minute. He's a little kid. Yo, what up? It's your boy Black with Black TV where we give reviews and hip hop news. And today I'm gonna be doing a review on Tay K's mixtape, hashtag Santana World. Don't forget to hit subscribe to Black TV for more reviews and more reactions. Hit a like, hit that notification bell, and in the comment section, tell me what is the big hype around this kid right here? Because I haven't actually heard any music of him. I wanted to do a review of his mixtape and see what he's all about. So with that being said, let's go ahead and give my thoughts on Tay K. Well, if you didn't know, Tay K is a 17 year old rapper out of Texas that's currently locked up off of weapon charges and murder. And recently his judge just announced that he is gonna be tried as an adult at 17 years old. And with all this going on, Tay K has a single on the Billboard charts called The Race. I'm pretty sure you heard of it. That's climbing, taller, climbing, just climbing the charts. I and mean, that's really remarkable for a guy of his stature. I haven't, like I said before, I haven't really heard anything on his music career or anything like that. I heard The Race. So I actually want to do a review on Tay K. And yeah, the mixtape's terrible. But let's go ahead and check out the cover first before I get into that. He's on his knee with some hundreds in his hand. Yeah, this is a perfect representation of Tay K in his hashtag same tunnel world. He's flexing. I mean, ain't nothing really remarkable about the cover. But let me go ahead and talk about what I actually like about this mixtape. I guess his lyrics is authentic. And I think that's one reason why a lot of people is growing close to his music just because of his uh, his uh, street cred and what he does in the street. And I don't know why people would like a person that's authentic in the streets but has no quality music whatsoever, but it's whatever. I mean, track three, I love my chopper. I can tell he tried to do a re rendition of Easy Ease in my 6-4 on this song. He almost did a, no, let me quit lying, it's terrible. But it, I can tell that he tried to do that and I salute him for trying to do that because out of the 10 tracks on this mixtape, this this basically is the best content to off, to, for him to offer. And I really didn't like it. I mean, but I, I I like the effort. I give him an A for effort. But my favorite song is, of course, Track One, The Race. It's because this actually sounds of what people now, this generation of rap, listen to. It's, it's The beat is catchy. I mean, it's not really a uh, product of a complete song, but I can see why people are growing to it, just as of many reasons I said before. But yeah, I, I'm not gonna lie. I like the race, even though he's rapping about nothing at all. The song is actually in the Billboard charts. I think it's my, it might be in the top 40 right now. Last time I checked, it's in the top 70s on the Billboard charts. And the video on YouTube has 6.5 million views. So obviously he's doing something right. But what I dislike about hashtag Santana World is that He's rapping about the same cliches any gangster rapper is talking about. Shooting, women, drugs, and just flexing. It just seems like he don't have no thought process whatsoever. He just went in the booth and rapped whatever he got. Like, it might have two songs on here, it might have choruses on here, but the rest is just him rapping over a beat. All the instrumentals, except for the race, is garbage. It's garbage. It sounds like all these instrumentals was made off of Fruity Loops. I'm not knocking Fruity Loops, but if you put Fruity Loops in front of a 10 year old child that has no knowledge whatsoever on how to work a computer, 
That's how the beat sound. All of them is just trash. Especially on track eight, that way. I hate those scents, them scents. The, it's just, it's just irritating. It made my ears bleed. But the worst song on this mixtape is track four, Lemonade. The, the beat is garbage. The quality is garbage, of course. And it's just, he, I think he had a course in there. He, he, he's saying, I drink lemonade. She drink, drink no, she drink lemonade. I'm drinking Lempton. Some, some BS. And as far as quality, like I said, it has to be the worst quality song on, out of all the 10 tracks because the reverb, I don't know, like on the ad libs, he, he tried to put an echo or the whatever he tried to do with the reverb on the ad libs. This song just made me, my ears just bleed. I had to wipe my, I had to wipe it off, bruh. But let me go ahead and get this video over with. I'm gonna go ahead and rate TK hashtag Santana World a three out of 10. It's just completely terrible. I wouldn't recommend it to anybody. I wouldn't recommend this to my worst enemy. But what do you think about TK's music? Do you like it? Do you hate it? Do you think he's an actual gangster rapper out here? He needs to be out here rapping. Do you think he's innocent? Do you think he actually murdered him? Leave it in the comment section below. Don't forget to hit subscribe to Black TV. If you want your music reviewed, hit me up on Instagram or Twitter at Black Music, B-L-A-C-M-U-Z-I-C. And until next time, I holla. Yeah! Fuck a beat, cause I'm trying to beat this case. I think that's what he said.